So you probably clicked on this video because you either got an Oculus for Christmas or you're just terribly bad at the game and need some help. Well, I'm here to help you. I'm gonna turn. I'm gonna teach you the basics and some tips and tricks to get you started. Let's start the video. <laughs> so when you first start the game, you're probably going to run like this. See how he's going up and not really going forward? He's more going up in the air. That's not what you want to do. You want to try to stay level to the ground like this and not go up like he was. This makes it so you can hit off the ground more and gives you way more speed. And then whenever you get good, you can start to do this. Or this. There are a lot of advanced ways to run in this game, but if you're getting started, I recommend just taking it slow and going like this. So next is jumping. Notice how he's pushing off the ground straight down and going straight up. If you push to the side, you're gonna go to the side. You wanna push straight down to get as much height as possible. This can help whenever you're juking. So if you run at me and I can jump over him and then bam, juked, ankles broken, life divorced, money burned. But yeah, all you wanna focus on is just not pushing to the side and just pushing straight down when you're jumping. So the next thing is pinch climbing. So you're gonna grab on, push down and grab again. And you're just gonna keep going up. It's kinda hard cause the lights are in the way, but I'll show you here. Grab, push down and grab again. You wanna keep doing that like this. It's honestly not that hard as long as you take your time. And then whenever you get better, you can go, Faster, faster. No! The next thing you're gonna wanna learn is probably wall bouncing. So wall bouncing is when you jump and you hit from wall to wall like he is, to the very top. This is the best spot to do it, but you can also do it in other spots. What you wanna do is you wanna push not straight off the wall, but kinda in a diagonal line. So you're going straight and up, like this. And you're gonna find yourself going forward, and that's okay, because that's what most people do in the very beginning. So even if you keep finding yourself uh, doing this, you could actually turn in real life, and that could help too, but it, it, it is pretty hard to do. Or you would just focus on not pulling back, but more just pushing straight down and diagonally instead of trying to actually go forward. So a juke is basically whenever you trip someone out. So if he's chasing me, what I can do is he thinks I'm gonna keep going, but I can hit off this and go right over his head. And net tricks them out, and then you could probably run this way and do something else. And as you can see, he's died. A juke that you can practice that's probably the easiest one to do is if he's running at me, I could just simply jump right over him. And sometimes they can't really suspect it if you're in a chase, and then they'll die. Okay, so another juke you can do is called the pull juke. If he's chasing me, what I can do is I can grab onto this and spin my direction, and it trips him out. So this is what it looks like from a different angle. So if he's chasing me, I really throw, and then he dies. So the next juke you're probably going to learn is called the slide juke. So go ahead and show him. You jump, you put your arm through, and you swing around. How this is done is your arm doesn't have a hitbox, so it can go right through it. So what you can do is you can put your arm through and then launch yourself out the other side. This is what it looks like from a different point of view. So he's chasing me, he's chasing me. Ooh, didn't know where I went, and then he dies once again. So the next thing you're probably gonna learn is wall running. So it's basically when you run on the wall. So notice how he's pushing down and forward and not pushing off the wall. If you push off the wall, you're gonna go, well, off the wall. Notice how I'm pushing down, straight down. And if you push straight down, you're probably, you're just gonna go forward. And if you're not going forward and you're just going straight up, you're trying to push back more. And this is how you want it. It gets pretty hard whenever it's just straight up. But if it's slightly diagonal, it's pretty easy. And that's basically how you do it. It takes a lot of practice to get used to, but, but it's definitely a must need skill to learn. Whenever you get so good, you could also just do two hands like this. So the first skill that's actually going to be challenging for you to learn is wall, wall climbing. So uh, show them when you just go from side to side and you climb right up the wall. Try to do it like a crevice. So what you want to do is you want to push down, but not straight down like wall running. Wall running is like that, but for this, you want to push out. But I'll go down and out, and you're just going to keep going from side to side. Like this. So you want to turn your whole body when you go side to side. So this isn't really a beginner thing, but Lucioing is a really hard uh, mechanic. It's when you go like this, 
on the wall and you go up it like it's really hard to do and i recommend watching a more advanced tutorial if you want to learn how to do it so the next thing you're going to learn probably is branching so branching is whenever you just keep going from branch to branch consecutively and juke everybody out so he's just kind of going from branch to branch kind of doing his own thing and he fell but basically it's just whenever you jump from branch to branch you hit off hit off stuff and ah, this is probably the most fun thing in my opinion like to actually do the last and probably most difficult thing to learn is scaling so it's whenever you jump keep hitting off the tree wrap around the branches to get really high up on the top of a tree so he, what he's doing is actually hitting off the tree try not to launch back if you launch just back then you'll miss all the branches so it's basically hitting up off the tree and then wrapping your arms around like this well see i'm not even good at it yet but you just kind of go upwards like that guess what i lied that wasn't the last thing the last thing we're gonna learn is called a vertical a vertical is just kind of like a harder lucio because it's only with one hand and you gotta go really fast so it's like you're basically just moving your hand in a circular motion like you're wall running but only going up this is actually pretty difficult and harder than it looks so go look at a more advanced tutorial you stupid so that's basically it if you followed everything in this video you should be pretty decent at the game unless like me it took you a really long time to learn and this is like your fifth tutorial you've watched i know the people i know who you are 90.1 and anyways that's it yep